What is up, Humanoid Nation? So today's video I'm going to be reacting to is by TLC UK. It's by this guy named Skippy. I've seen some videos of him on the internet. This guy is extremely cringe. I've never seen this full video from the Virgin Diaries, but from what I've seen of him online, this dude is super, super, super cringy. <sighs> All right. Fun single or ready to mingle on the Virgin Diaries. Let's go. I want a girl to be like, wait, you're sing how are you still single? He just really to say that while he's wearing a Virginity Rocks t-shirt. Looking like the Numa Numa guy. And some handballs right there to relieve stress. What the hell do you do to your wall there? Is that like a... Okay. All right, all right. I want a girl to be like, wait, you're sing how are you still single? Skippy, a 34-year-old Mormon virgin, living in his parents' basement. Okay. Hey, Mom? My body is a... like a temple record. Uh, the shirt you're wearing, dude. The ideal girl isn't thinking that her ideal guy Utah Virgin. There's a joke there. I'm not even going to go there. Still lives at home in mom's basement, right? Mom! Coming! But I do. Would you like to know how badly I want to have sex with a girl? It's all I've been able to think about all last night. I just like sit there with girls sometimes on dates like, you're the cutest, you're the sweetest, you're the best. Let's go. You want to go? Not sure if you want to go on. Bro, I thought I was bad when I be got out of, co out of high school because I was like really, really. I was like this guy, but not like this guy. I was awkward as fuck out of high school. I couldn't talk to women. And then I stopped giving a fuck cause you, when you get older. But yeah. This guy. Oh my God. He's just coming up too strong. My guy, he guy. My guy. On a date with me? Well, would a t-shirt change your mind? I made out with Skippy for three minutes, and all I got was this lousy t-shirt. Make the world a better place. Put a kiss on Skippy's face. You may be thirsty for some Skippy. Got Skippy? Huh? You're gonna get sued, bro. Huh? Huh? Going out to meet girls. I guess we were going by and like that one. <laughs> to be shitty me he has a wing mom and he has a different shirt he makes his own shirt oh seriously wing mom oh you are so weird what are you doing no you... she's so weird she's the weird one no no don't circle around me because that's gonna no don't no just walk up and be like son remember the girl from like two songs ago she was cute maybe you should ask her again okay my role is wing mom and so i'll kind of keep an eye on the ladies when I meet the girl that I fall in love with, I want her and my mom to be really good friends. That's a good idea. This is gonna be so cool. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so, oh, there's a white t-shirt over there that looks like she might be good for you. Tonight could be the beginnings of my start to eternal bliss. Right here. Would you like to dance? What's your name? Alexis. If you take time to get to know Skippy, you'll find you really, really like him, and hey, he might be marriageable material then. I hate to be that guy, but when you go out to random girls in a club or something like this and say you want to dance, 90, 80 percent of them will say no. But since there's a camera there, they know there's a camera there. They see a camera. The cameraman's right in the way. Of course, they're gonna say yes, because like TV and stuff, you don't want to look like an asshole. I'm just saying. You know, I totally forgot to put on clothes. I feel embarrassed because usually I smell really good. Thank you for the dance. Thank you. That was fun. Do you want to meet my mom? Oh, yeah. My mom. I'll talk with you about her in a second. I'm really sweaty. And there's an outlet in the bathroom, so I'm going to go dry off. Okay. Guys, this is Skippy. Hi guys. 
I've got so much more personality than any other guy in here. Like, it's a race for number two, because the, like, funniest, the most creative guy just walked into the room. What is your name? I'm Stephanie. Oh, Stephanie. Hi, Stephanie. I'm, oh, I'm Skippy. Nice to meet you. This is our party, sort of. His, but mine. Skippy likes to make t-shirts. I do. Skippy, stop, Skippy. You gotta stop. This guy must be self-aware. Or is he just a giant troll doing this for clout? I swear, nobody can be this not self-aware. Like I said, I was kind of like Skippy back in the day, but not to this degree. Oh my god, I knew when to stop saying stupid shit like that. Even yeah, 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 yeah. Because I am, in fact, fun and single and ready to mingle. But I have other shirts too. Are you? Yes. How single are you, though? I see Skippy do certain things. And I'm just like, oh man, somebody's got to talk to this guy. And I, I just told him, I said, Skippy, you gotta, you gotta kind of come off a little bit less excited. If you do want to bless me, my answer yeah, is yes. And then you can have this awesome shirt. You brought your own merchandise. Do you sell them, or do you just give them out for free? Come on, bro. You gotta tell me you sell them so you can make a profit at least. Tell me at least you sell them. What if I kiss you on the cheeks? No, 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 no. It says I made out with Skippy for three minutes. It doesn't say I kissed Skippy on the cheek. Skippy doesn't really listen, so I'm trying to help him to see that, you know, play a little bit more cool or a little bit more casual when you're, when you're meeting girls. I, I need a girlfriend. I'm in a rut in my life where I need companionship. Uh, what Jimmy has in- Skippy is the kind of guy that can't be alone. Like, being alone is not good enough for him. He has to have somebody with him. Like, I know people like this. Like, I, I got a friend that always needed to be in a relationship, no matter what. If he was single, he was depressed. Even when he was in a relationship, he was depressed. But the man could not be alone or single for a little amount of time. Skippy right here, he needs to be with someone. Just can't be alone is what I see from him. Bless him. I get what he's trying to do, but it's very cringy and stuff. But yeah, come on, man. Like, I can see that this guy does not want to be alone and is really, really hard, trying hard to be with someone all the time. People are like that. Some people are like that. Muscles I have in personality. I hate to brag, but that's kind of the case. So I'm 34 years old. I'm a virgin and I'm awesome. I'm really awesome and I'm a good person. And if you got to know me, you would think so too. I feel like we need to get to know each other a little better. I would love I agree. He's a good person. It's better. just the way he comes off. So Do you nice feel that? There is chemistry here, right? Absolutely. Yeah. I really, he has the kindness heart. He's so oh, great. the crush, man. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think he's great. He's a great kid. God. Again, not to be, I hate to be that guy, but mm -hmm. just saying that because there's cameras there. Just saying, I don't want to be an asshole, but it's a TV show. They want to look good. They don't want to look like a bleak dick. So, yeah, you're going to be on TV. Go on a date with this guy. Hey, he'll give me exposure. At least I'll be on TV. Sure, why not? Ah. Oh. For me, right? For me. Woo! At least he's got a positive Woo! attitude. I like that he has a positive attitude. You don't even go out for dinner at I'm least? I'm gonna get that for you. Thank you. Oh, I should totally give you a tour. Okay, perfect. Welcome to my room. Here's my poster of the Osmonds, and over here is my belly button link collection. What, man? And over here is my belly button link collection. Skippy. Why? My God. Extreme silence while talking. How many guys that you've gone on dates with in the last year you still live at home? Next question. <laughs> Do you have your future kids' names picked out? Uh, no. I've had my future kids' names picked out since I was 14. Girl, you need to get out of there. I don't want to go on a first date with a girl and 
ever think that I'm interviewing her to be my wife, but it's always in the back of my head. So now what? You gotta stop overanalyzing, got, um, my guy. Got a surprise. Don't go anywhere if you want to kind of clean this up or something like that, but I'll be right back down. What okay. a great first date. Invite that. him to dinner, and then you had to clean up after. She doesn't even know what to do. Surprise, can you come in and uh, share your talents with us? Brought over a do with a guitar. All right. Are you going to even offer him some pizza? Can we slow down? Can we slow down? Sure. <laughs> yeah, but you better have given some pizza be for doing this. You be a little spin? I but, like a girl that's... By the, by the way, where do you find a guy that can play guitar when you go on a date? Do you, do you call him beforehand? When you go on this date, it's like, hey, buddy, uh, I have this girl over at my place. Uh, can you come over and play guitar? It's like, sure, bud. When would you like me to come over? It's like, uh, after we have dinner, so... Uh, where do you want me to be? Like, uh, oh, just upstairs, like uh, uh, like how you wait on Wayne's World where you can just sit in the kitchen table. And then I can come up and get you. <laughs> this seriously reminds me of Wayne's World. They're doing their shit downstairs and like their guests are like upstairs in the kitchen just talking to Wayne's mom. So this dude is just talking to Skippy's mom the entire time. Shorter than me, I want to be able to put my arm around her and just kind of like sway at a concert. Like to me, that's great, and to me, that's cute. And whenever I see people doing that, I'm like, oh, I want to be them. <laughs> let, let, let go over Skippy. Let go over Skippy. I aspire to be a great big spoon. That come on. Awesome. So if you want to start heading upstairs, there's like one last little surprise at the end of the night. Okay. You overplanned a lot, you. my dude. <laughs> That's overplanning a lot. She's ready to go too. <laughs> it's like upstairs, I got a surprise for you. She instantly goes for her purse and all her stuff. She goes like, I'm out of here no matter what. Before I give you this and before I walk you to the door, I really do think that I did pretty good on this date. If maybe if I ask nicely, can I please just give you a kiss? And sometimes when you say please like that, that's way too desperate. Like, I get it. You want consent. Sure, on the first date, it'd be cute to say, like, you mind if I kiss you? That's pretty cool. But him saying, can I please give you a quiz kiss? You know by her facial expressions, like, bruh. You just are horny, and you just want to kiss. Wait, what the kiss. hell? And sometimes you just are horny, and you just want to kiss, and you want like some rough stuff, but not Bishop, not talk to Bishop rough, but you want kind of like ah. It doesn't have to be giant, but can you can, can I give you? Cheek. Oh, friend right? zone. Can I just can I just give you a kiss, please? Kitty, I just I don't kiss on the first date. That's bullshit, okay, ma'am. To kiss a girl shouldn't be a shock. That call, that's kind of bullshit. She do kiss on the first date, but not with him. She's, you've been creeping her out this entire time. Skippy, you're a good man, but... Oh my god, dude. You're a positive dude, but come on. To a cute girl. It should kind of be expected, right? Stop, dude! Stop! She said no! And what was mom just appearing out of nowhere? She's just standing there in the background. Thank you. That's all for tonight, Skippy. Ooh. Laying down the law. Yeah, this my boy Skippy right here. He's the type of guy that can't be alone. He must have someone to be with all the time. There's a lot of people like that I've met through the years. They absolutely need to be with someone because they can't be with themselves by themselves because they're constantly thinking of being in a relationship or being with a girl. They can't just be single and be happy. They're constantly looking for someone. But yeah, Skippy, he's a, as a Mormon, he's like very positive. He looks happy, 
I'm just wondering if he's truly happy on the inside. Because there's a lot of videos about him taping this stuff, recording his dates. And that's kind of creepy that he just takes a, he just video records his dates all the time. I'm going to check out some more of his stuff later on, but right now this is just way too much. <laughs> but yeah, TLC, man. Uh, wow, okay. Anyways, that's it for now, Human Nation. Human Freak Freakout. Bye. Pasito a pasito, suave, suavecito. Nos vamos pegando poquito a poquito.